Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can add a sticky add to cart button in your Shopify store. So in this sticky add to cart, you can actually display the product image, product title, price. You can also add a quantity selector and variant selector and then you can also add add to cart button so this is super simple you only need to copy and paste the code by following the steps which i'm going to show you in this video so that will be helpful for your customers because the customers will able to easily add to cart your product from mobile view as well as desktop view so let me show you step by step that how you can do it into your store please don't forget to subscribe this channel because uh, i am putting more content on future videos so let me go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that i have installed down theme if you have any other theme then still this will work all right so the current situation is like right now i have this product page and I've, i'm scrolling down and we don't have any kind of uh, sticky add to cart button right now so let me show you how we can do that so you should go to the dashboard and here you should click on these three dots duplicate the theme and then after you should click on edit code here we have some folders and files so actually we need to create a section so for that you should click on section and then click on add a new section and here you need to paste the name of the section so actually i already written the documentation so you should copy the name like sticky dash add to cart like sticky dash atc copy it and then you should paste the name here and then click on done so in that way you are actually creating an empty file so you should remove everything from inside and paste the fresh code which is this one sticky dash add to cart dot txt so you should copy this complete code and then paste it right here in the empty file and then after you should click on save so that's how you are actually creating a sticky add to cart button file and now we have to move to the second step which is we need to include this section in theme.liquid since we are interested to put it in the footer sec footer part so how we can do that you should actually uh, go to layout click on theme.liquid scroll it down and actually you should find here footer so wherever will be the footer code so here you can see that we have footer dash group so that means uh, below the footer we are going to paste that new line of code so that is this one so section sticky dash atc so this is this was the section we created and we are going to include it right here then you should click on save so in that way you actually saved the changes and now the sticky add to cut button is included into theme.liquid so let's see the customization part that how it looks now so you should go back to the dashboard again and here you need to click on customize and once you are clicking on customize then you should go to the product page of the store because in the product page only the sticky add to cart button will be displaying so you should click here click on products and here we have default product here we go now you can see that the product is loading here and if you are scrolling uh, in the left side you can see that at the bottom we have sticky add to cart so right now you can see that if I am scrolling down, so you can see that we have this sticky add to cart button showing. So actually this is the title, we have the price, we have the product image, and we also have the uh, drop down where we have uh, all the variants, color variants, and then we have the uh, quantity selector and then add to cart. So let's move ahead step by step. If you wanted to disable it, you can actually uncheck this uh, checkbox and automatically this will be hiding. You can also change the color so for example i am switching to this color so let me save the changes and then if you are viewing it after so now you can see that the background color and the text color everything is changed because according to the color schema so whichever color schema you wanted to put for example i am putting here black let me save the changes here we go now you can see that we have black so in the same way right now i am putting it schema 2 that is uh, the i mean gray color so that is looking more better so now you can see that this is looking like this if you wanted to change the title size title size means this size so for say example i am putting it h2 let me save the changes and then you can actually see here like the title size is increased and here also we have the image so if you are interested to show the image you can uncheck this box otherwise you can also hide this image also okay then we have show quantity field so we are already showing the quantity field if you are interested to hide it you can also uncheck this here and automatically this will be hiding okay so that's how you can actually add to your uh, shopify store and this is super simple and easy let me show you the mobile view that how it looks 
so here we go now you can see in mobile view it is looking like this we have the product image we have the title and we have the uh, uh, drop down of color variant and then we have the add to cart button one more thing is like if you wanted to uh, make changes to the add to cart button you can click on secondary let me save the changes and the uh, color background color will be updated here here we go now you can see that we have add to cart button so that is like secondary and we are putting it a primary for now that is looking more attractive right now so if you will have any kind of background which you will have added into other buttons so automatically that will be applied here all right so that's how you can actually do it into your store so that is super simple if we are previewing this product so let me scroll it down and here in the bottom you can see that this is looking like this let me see the mobile view so in the mobile view if you are scrolling down and at the bottom you have uh, this sticky add to cart button with add to cart button color variant and all and title and uh, everything i mean uh, the price so if you are facing any issue or something you can ask i will help you out in that please don't forget to subscribe the channel because i always uh, put more valuable content for you so that you get the help out of it so thank you so much for watching this video if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video you can follow me on tiktok uh, facebook and instagram you can also join the group of whatsapp where we have some members where we can share the content if you have any new feature to develop or you have any problem with something so you can uh, message me i will help you out in that thank you once again see you in the next video